All right, everyone. Okay, today we're going to learn how to use the bool function. It's used to add or subtract things. Okay, let's get right to it. What I mean, add or subtract things. Okay, so we get a box here. I want to punch a hole in it. So I'm going to put a cylinder. I'm going to punch a hole in it. Uh, let's rotate this 90 degrees. Uh, let's make this a little bit bigger. Okay, so I want to punch a, a hole in it, so I bring up the bool function, it's right here, uh, and it's on subtract. If you wanted to make this uh, cylinder part of the this box, this cube, you will put on union, and it will add the two together. But I'm showing you subtract first, so subtract, so the object the main object you want to put in first and then whatever you want to punch the hole with you put in second and ta-da there it is now say if you want to punch another hole let's put a cube let's put a cube okay so we want to punch another hole into this box of ours so we drag it and see what happens it doesn't do anything so once you have it set up where the main ones here and you have gotta punch a hole here if you want to put another thing in here to punch a hole and excuse me for my talking guys cuz uh, I'm not uh, a genius or anything see you gotta punch you got another hole so what it is it's bull it's a subtract B so you got a here and this is B so anything under B will be punching a hole. So if you want a third one, you want to punch that in, you will put it under cylinder, anywhere, it doesn't matter. And then that punches a hole. And that is how you use bull. Now if you want all these to be part of it, you just change this to union, and it becomes part of it. See, it's no longer a single object. Well, it still is technically until you uh, combine it all. But if now, if you want to make it a single object, all this together, you just highlight everything. I like to go right click, select children, then you have to make it edible. Then from there, you select children again and you right click it connect objects and delete and that way it becomes one object and then you can go from there and do whatever you want alright thanks for watching this video